change of events has me totally stumped. The guns, the bombs, I'm done with work. Gotta get out before they shut the door. So that would be a thought of an immigrant? Uh, yes, that would probably be a thought, like, in somewhere like North Korea where you can't get out. Leaving your home, finding another. They are some of the biggest issues facing our country, put in lyrics. The lake is treated like a toilet. Whether it be things in Canadian politics. We wanted the Prime Minister know, to know that we wanted the First Nations to have a clean water. Or history. What makes people move out of their countries and come into Canada from like times long ago? Written by students from grade 5 to grade 8. The lyrics describe things ranging from their own experiences. You could express your feelings and writing a song and you could tell the whole entire world about it. To things like the Battle of 1812, the Halifax Explosion and Prohibition. The burning of the White House in the War of 1812, uh, the first and last hangings in Toronto in the justice system. It's tough uh, they, to make a song about that. And yet they did and it's catchy so it's a, it's a really great way to celebrate the 150th uh, anniversary of Confederation. But more than just being a unique way to celebrate Canada's 150, the students found writing these lyrics actually made them learn the history better. The tune, you remember the tune and then the words come to your mind and suddenly remember. The students will be performing these songs at a concert in Parkdale this weekend, but in a couple of weeks you will be able to listen to all of them online. For a link to that, go to our website citynews.ca slash extras. In Parkdale, Audra Brown, City News.